Okay, now we're gonna talk about laying row lock window seals. Um, you'll have to pretend that there's a window here. Uh, you're always gonna to wanna to have less mortar on the front than the back. So you spread normal, and then you just kinda of give it a little bit of this so that you can be tighter on the front to have a slight tilt to it. Every brick for modular brick is three row lock. So you can simply, especially if you have a big run, just follow your joints and make sure that you're on scale. If it's an odd size window, you might wanna scale it out and put pencil marks and follow the pencil marks so that you close good. Always be thinking two moves in front of yourself. Now, one of the things that I really wanna talk about is this back of this joint. So I see a lot of mistakes where people, they, they uh, when they mud their brick, they, hit, they don't hit this backside where it's a snap half. And what happens is, you can see right here, that joint's not full. We have a void there. Now whenever the window frame is there, trying to tuck that hole in, you can make a smeared up mess on the window. I've even seen it where the hole was so big that it just kept on filling up and filling up. And then you wanna make sure that you got nice full joint on the underside as well. See, I have a hole. Now, the way that you avoid that is you gotta hit the back every time. So what I do is I hit that back just like as if it's not a, a cut. And by hitting the back, now I have a full joint, no hole. Every single time, that little extra swipe when you're, when you're mudding your head joint, that little extra move is all it takes to be the difference between hole and no hole. Always cut your mud away. You don't want to smear this up, especially if you're on the second, third floor, you're going to see the underside of that sill. So be meticulous with your movements. See, there's a little bit of, a, I put a little extra dab on there. Always Hit the back. You can see the difference right here. That extra move of swiping the back and then when you don't do it. 